when him and I ever started like hooking up or like anything of that sort, he was not ever in a relationship ever at any point. I would never, it's not my character to mess with someone's relationship. I would just never do that. I was raised better than that. If you've been on TikTok or Instagram recently, you may have heard about the latest Selena Gomez and Hailey Bieber's drama. Selena Gomez and Justin Bieber dated on and off from 2010 to 2018 with many fans believing Bieber still has feelings for the singer and actress. The two women since have been at the center of feud rumors since 2018, when Hailey married Justin Bieber just six months after he'd split from Selena following a seven-year on-off romance. The two women are often pitted against each other, with fans of the pair reading into their social media posts. So, what happened between them and where they are now? Hailey Bieber was accused of shading Selena Gomez after she was body shamed in a now deleted TikTok video in January 2023. The video shows 26 year old Hailey alongside Kendall Jenner and Justine Skye, lip syncing the sound, and I'm not saying she deserved it, but God's timing is always right. The video came very soon after the only murders in the building actress was body shamed over photos of her on vacation in Mexico and attending the Golden Globes. Selena responded to the body shaming comment in an Instagram live in January 2023. But we don't care. I never comment on this type of thing, but we were just having a girl's night and did a random TikTok sound for fun. It's not directed at anyone, Haley commented on a TikTok about the shade. It's okay. I don't let these things get me down. Be nice to everyone. X, Selena responded in a comment about Baldwin. Haley Bieber, who is the daughter of actor Stephen Baldwin, was accused of shading Selena Gomez last month when she posted an Instagram story with Rema's 2022 song, Calm Down. Selena was featured on a remix of the song, but Haley posted the version without her. Haley Bieber and Kylie Jenner were accused of making fun of Selena Gomez's eyebrows in February. A little earlier in the month, Selena posted a TikTok video of her bushy eyebrows, telling her followers, I accidentally laminated my eyebrows too much. Instead, this is me. I accidentally laminated my brows too much. After Selena's TikTok video, Haley's close friend Kylie posted a photo on her Instagram story of her own eyebrows with the caption, This was an accident? She then posted screenshot of a FaceTime call between her and Haley with the pair showing close-ups of their eyebrows. Kylie denies they were making fun of Haley. This is reaching. No shade towards Selena ever and I didn't see her eyebrow posts. You guys are making something out of nothing. This is silly, Kylie commented on a TikTok video about the subject. Selena called the rumors unnecessary and claimed she was a fan of the youngest Jenner sister. On February 23, 30-year-old Selena Gomez replied to a TikTok post that described Taylor Swift as a mean girl and a bully. The post she replied featured a resurfaced video from 2017, in which Hailey Bieber made a gagging motion when Taylor Swift was mentioned during the televised rap battle Drop the Mic. Gomez defended Swift in the comment sections, replying to the post, so sorry, my best friend is and continues to be one of the best in the game. Selena Gomez announced February 23 that she was taking time off from social media. It came on the same day she dethroned Kylie Jenner as the most followed woman on Instagram. I love who I am, and yeah, I'm going to be taking a second from social media cause this is a little silly, Gomez told her followers. And I'm 30, I'm too old for this. But I love you guys so much and I will see you guys sooner than later. Selena did return, writing and posting a beauty tutorial, please, please be kinder and consider others' mental health. My heart has been heavy and I only want good for everyone. All my love. It was also reported that Kylie Jenner and Hailey Bieber lost followers in the wake of the shade, whilst Selena's popularity only grew. A stylist who works with Hailey Bieber has sparked outrage online after declaring he hates Selena Gomez. Fashion stylist Vaughn Ford, who has worked with Chloe Bailey, Charlie XCX and Bella Hadid shared a message via Instagram stories that stated, I hate Selena Gomez. The post was allegedly taken down by Instagram. He added a caption over the screenshot that read, I said what I said. Justin Bieber's surprise rolling loud performance was disturbed by the audience chanting insults at his wife. Give it, give it up for Don Tyler one time. <laughs> 
The incident has since prompted an outpouring of support for Haley Bieber, with fans of both the model and the singer taking to social media to condemn the behavior. As much as I dislike her, this is just so mean and wrong on so many levels, one person wrote on Twitter, Will Stanither said, I'm definitely not a fan of either of them, but I think this is going way too far. They are still human. Plus, we don't know the whole story. We don't even know if what we heard is true or not. The TikTok discourse regarding Selena Gomez and Hailey Bieber has continued over the month, despite both women publicly moving on. Selena publicly called the online hate to end on the morning of March 24, revealing that the two women had spoken privately. Hailey allegedly told Selena that she was getting death threats. Selena shared on her Instagram stories, Hailey Bieber reached out to me and let me know that she has been receiving death threats and such hateful negativity. This isn't what I stand for. No one should have to experience hate or bullying. I've always advocated for kindness and really want this all to stop. Justin Bieber and Haley Baldwin dated for six months in 2016 before reuniting in 2018, a month after Justin's breakup with Selena Gomez. Bieber and Baldwin were engaged in July 2018 and married in the September of that year. In an interview on the Call Her Daddy podcast in 2022, Haley explained how she and Justin got back together and confirmed Bieber did not cheat on the pop star when him and I ever started. When him like, and I ever started, like, hooking up or, like, anything of that sort, he was not ever in a relationship. Ever. At any point. I would never... It's not my character to mess with someone's relationship. I would just never do that. I was raised better than that. Although she and Justin were both single when they got back together in 2018, the famous model revealed on the podcast that she could understand how she and Justin's relationship appeared differently from the outside. That was a situation where I, I know for a fact that it was the right thing for them to close that door. They were not in a relationship at that time. But of course, there's a very long history there and it's not my relationship. It has nothing to do with me. So I respect that a lot. But I know that it closed a chapter and I think it was the best thing that could have happened for him to move on and be engaged and get married and like move on with with his life in that way. 